Well, good morning. <clears throat> I got here uh, out here a little earlier. I've already done some work. So now I'm back from the local big box hardware store to pick up what a few things that I needed. And one of them was some more plywood, the uh, quarter inch plywood. And that is to make some more of the bender board, which is gonna be utilized right there. I gotta take that off and then continue the new up and around and up to the top. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna show you the other side. And this side's not as bad, just the first couple, two, three layers are bad. It's gonna be replaced and then I'm going to uh, go ahead and uh, reuse. And the other side too, I'm gonna to reuse the bottom three layers and then they are the longest and then replace the rest. So I'll show you how it goes along. All right, talk to you guys later. And as you can see, I did uh, pull back the, uh, the roof so that I can get to work on it. So uh, I'll show you uh, how it goes. Hopefully I'll be pulling this roof back over. Talk to you guys later. Hey guys, just wanted to show you. I got this whole side done. So now you can see what that bender board looks like completely done from the bottom all the way to the top, all the way around, curved, beautiful. So that'll hold it, that'll suspend it, and that's what's gonna hold the shape of your your metal, your aluminum skin, all the way around. All right, but now I'm gonna show you how I actually do it. So I'm gonna set it up, set up the camera so you can see how I'm doing it. I'm gonna remove the old and then start putting on the new. Here we go.
Okay, so you saw me take off the old, put on the new, and it really didn't take that long. Now, I did have the pieces pre-cut, but I knew what the size were because I cut them for the other side, and they, were they are identical as far as, there are one inch wide strips uh, cut across the grain on the um, plywood. There's only three ply. So the center ply uh, in the um, in the plywood is going the long way. So all the, the ply on the outside and the ply that's face down is going cross cut. So that allows the, the plywood to bend. So, but anyways, now you can see again how it's done. I got some spaces over here. I'm gonna show you real quick that I have to uh, fill in, which is right up in there. But those are just small pieces. Slide them in place, nail them down. That's it, I'm done. So what I'm gonna do today, and I do have um, the insulation. You saw me rip off the old insulation. Yes, I am ripping it off. I'm not gonna use it again. I'm putting in the new insulation. So I'll put that in and, uh, and then lower the uh, skin back down and hopefully mount everything down on the skin at least at the bottom just to hold it in place because I have to take off the um, the uh, fan and work on that uh, piece over the fan over the center so with that I hope uh, you got a better idea on how this uh, bender board now you know why it's called bender board or edge board because they do both the same they're on the edge and they do bend so either name is I'm sure proper uh, most people will know that I've done this before I uh, will know what you're talking about when you mention it with that talk to you guys later I'll show you an update a little bit later on bye okay I'm back all right it's getting a little late now it is uh, oh, what time is it 530 already Wow all right well just about finishing up and I'm just gonna have to fold this over the tin pull it back over and that's exactly what I was going to do is just show you what I've done so far so I finished the edge board or the uh, bender board whatever you want to call it okay that's then and I've filled in the void areas took out the old insulation which was absolutely nothing put this in this has a one inch and I believe the one inch has an R rating of 10 which is probably a heck of a lot more than it had before so I'm gonna close this up put a couple screws on the bottom just to hold it in place and then tomorrow I will attack the top but I, what I'm gonna do is fold the front over towards the back so all right just wanted to see you before I want to show you what I did today and it's all ready to go ready to go in fact, I'll show you the light fixture. I put that in today, right now, and just uh, show you that. So there it is. There was a, a light there, and that's where the light's going to continue to be, which is right there. All right. So with that, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good evening. Thanks for watching, and hope to see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Okay, just wanted to show you real quick that I buttoned it up. Supposedly we're supposed to get some rain tomorrow, so I'm going to come back out here and put some plastic on this. But I buttoned it up and I uh, put some screws in down at the bottom where they're supposed to go. So hopefully I won't have to reopen it. Shouldn't have to for any reason, but it's closed up and uh, everything matches up real good. So that's what we wanted. All right, talk to you guys later. That's what I wanted to show you. And uh, thanks for watching again. Bye.